Hi everybody, this is Dan Moser here, and today I'm going to show you a Reaper tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Recomp to do sidechain compression. You'll need to understand how to use compression, and have an understanding of the interface of Reaper. Let's start Reaper now. I'm going to load a project I already have saved. As you can see, there are three tracks, a bass, a kick, and a snare. Let's open up the effects panel on the track that we wish to do sidechain compression on. Then select Recomp from the list. I'm just going to set the threshold and ratio randomly here, so you can hear the compressor in action without a sidechain. Now I'm going to open up the I.O. panel on my bass track, and change the number of track channels to 4. Then I'll add a new receive from the channel that I wish to sidechain with, in this case the kick track. Making sure that I send audio 1 and 2 from that track into 3 and 4 on the bass track, the ones we just created. Now we'll open the recomp on my bass track again, and change the detector inputs to auxiliary L and R. This tells the compressor to use the signal that we just set up a receive for. You can also set it up as a send. In this case, I'll use the snare track. Remembering to send a 3 and 4 on the bass track. The reason this works is because we've set our detector inputs to auxiliary L and R. And because we've sent the signal that we wish to sidechain from to channels 3 and 4 on the track that we wish to do sidechain compression on. It's as simple as that. Thanks for watching. I'm Dan Moser.